What a horrible night to have a nightmare. To have a little nightmare. To have a little nightmare. Did you know where you were going when you started that bit? No. Okay. But it is a horrible night to have a nightmare. Why? Can you, you want to scoot a little over this way? Maybe no. Tell you're down in the corner again. No. I yeah. feel like you gravitate towards the corners. Well, I don't want to be in the of way. Of the webcam. It's I always. I don't want to be in the way. I don't want to. <laughs> what are you doing the down way. there? Get in here. Oh, someone got a dog. Who got a dog? Realistic dog got a dog. Realistic dog got a dog? Congrats on your dog. Is that allowed? Is it allowed for dog to have dog? Thank you I for so. compliments on my sweaters, everyone. I made it when I was a baby. Mm -hmm. This is my actual handprint and footprint from when I was a baby. <laughs> oh, you such a special little dog. This was my grandmother's sweatshirt, and she gave it to me. The sweatshirt's literally 30 years old. <laughs> And somehow wow. still functional as a, as a garment. And it like fits you really well. It was waiting for me to grow up. Yeah, really. So that it could be. She picked a, a good size for you. She knew. She I knew. think she knew. Even then. Even 30 years ago. I'm not wearing anything cool today. I'm sorry. You got the. It's all you, cheap you're wearing a Bioshock Infinite shirt. I'm wearing a Bioshock Infinite shirt. It's it's a, a that's discreet. It. I found it in the back of my wardrobe today. Discreet gamer clothes. Discreet gamer clothes. I love discreet gamer clothes. We don't want any explicit gamer. I almost said explicit gamer icons, but you do have a Triforce tattoo, which is a pretty explicit gamer icon. Someone did ask me if I was a, a big fan of math. Because it's all my tattoos. Because of the triangles? Yeah, because I was holding on to the pole and the train, and someone was like, oh, you really like math? And I was like, how are you such a nerd that you missed the nerd thing? You went too deep. Too you went nerd, too, too, too far. Pull deep. back. Pull back. You too nerd deep. Too nerd deep. And then I have a whole golden compass tattoo. So, But this one's subtle. Somebody was making a joke saying Julia glasses how, but Julia's got new glasses coming in. I got new glasses coming and in. And let me tell you, when she rocks the new glasses on stream, everyone's going to be in chat saying Julia glasses how. Um, Because they're looking good. I've seen them. Thanks. I had my eyes checked, and very excitedly, the doctor told me that the amoeba did not go too deep into my eye. So it's all superficial scars. Yay! I mean, you also had the amoeba like... How long ago? Yeah, but it doesn't like get pushed out. Yeah, I just mean like, um, it's been a while. So like, it's good that it's yeah, that it's like stayed the same basically. Yeah, and hasn't gotten worse. Yeah, yeah, that's why I'm I'm also excited. Every time I go to the doctor and have my eyes checked, I panic a little bit. You think it's gonna like come back? Well, no, Round I two. just think it's gonna do worse things because, like, the doctor said that it's it's possible. Listen, we're not here to talk about sad eyeball <laughs> stories. Well, we were talking about the glasses. We were talking about how good you'll look in your new glasses. Positive, and I'll be able, and I'll be able to see that positive look story because the amoeba didn't mess up my eye that bad. It always you all. It's always the amoeba with you, and never the glasses. <laughs> yeah. Um, I want to read some subs. Will you let me do this? Yeah. I can let me you scroll. scroll let me these? scroll because okay. I gotta scroll on my own pace. It's like when Thank you're you, trying Mama to Librarian. when someone's trying to like show you an article and they're like scrolling and you're like you didn't do it at the right time so like I lo I lost it mid sentence. Yeah, I got I got gotcha. you. We've got subs from Northern Expose, Annie Zan, Countess Leroth, Nokia Kiosk Worker gave out ten subs. Thank you so much. Thanks. Peckish Cowboy, it's Spooky Kabuki, Double Joe Seven. Seb Gaunt, Residential Hero, Dear Wester, in Bikias, Heart Sleeve, Art Seas, Doc Stitch, Needlessly Critical, Stranded Together, Ben 610, Da Bubby, gave out five da subs. Da Bubby, our, our incredible benefactor. Yeah. Hannah Likes D&D, &D. Yurt Gert gave out five subs. Thank you so much. Lava Lee Clan, Kitty Coran. Kitty Coran gave out 10 subs. Kitty Coran, our other benefactor. Dang. Um, not this mammal, Liz, LF Pneumatic, Dread Robot gave out five subs, Toasterous, Livable Jumble, Mostly Very Tired, The Antoine 2003, Games 396, Board Librarian, Bong Witch, Demon Tanuki, Mike Droid, The Librarian, Two Years of Librarian, 
And two what a years, two years two it's years. been. Yo Atikas, of course, subscribed. Edgeworth's Lavender Socks. That's so good. <laughs> Very specific. Yurt Gert gave out five more subs. Thank you so much, Yurt Gert. Dang. Cantaloper, Negapole, Clockwork Koala, Nader Raid, Jade is Great, Inspector Sassy Pants, Truck 909, TKO Musician gave out five subs. Kate Tries to Bake, Jenna Hello, Jeff 3PO, It's Trilby, Zeldan 64140, It's Loop Liches, Cantaloper, Boy with the Earring, Just Bilal 24. You're Boy with the Earring. I'm Boy with Ear Rings. Oh, true. And not, neither one of them is rings. Not yet. They're studs. Kelamendra, Shadowhex92, Oda T, Charlie, Charlie, Jugfrug. Charlie, Jugfrug. It's me, Dit Dit, gave out two subs. Forever Covered in Fur, Existential Meow, gave out three subs. Garbage Salt, Dangerous Person, Brad Nader, and Gamer Bun, thank you all so much. What? Did you like my joke? What did you say? I was busy trying to read the subs. Just tell me what you said. My genius is lost. This probably was really good. <laughs> I bet, based on your normal. Don't lie to me. I bet it was really good. Don't lie to me. I was trying to do my job. <laughs> what, what was your joke? You read one name that sounded like la la lu la la, so I said sha la lu la la. Okay. <laughs> I'm glad we've devoted this amount of time to it. I don't think anyone heard it. I see a lot of people saying they didn't hear your joke. I think it was too quiet. Mate. Next time, scream the joke. <laughs> Shall I love? Scream it as loud as you can. My goodness. Uh, we also got some more subs from Tickled Panda, Zamzos, Petite Booger, and A. Ty Meyer. So thank you uh, all very much for that. Julia, what are we playing? Little Nightmares 2. Little Nightmares? Little Nightmares 2. We played it a week ago. That we did. And we're back now. Yep. I got shot a lot and I fell off the books as we do. Yep. And where did we leave off last time? I guess we're still in the school, huh? We're still in the school where the teacher with the very long neck. Yeah. Um is is coming for us. This game is spooky for everyone who doesn't know. Or couldn't figure that out from the title. Yeah. Um, I do have the controller put up, so you should use that. And I will move the mouse away. Away! 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 Uh, the audio might be loud. We'll have to see. Because we had it turned up for There Is No Game. Right. Oh, uh, right. I just got past all the raucous children. I got a question for you right out the gate from Jaxadu. Said, Julie, do you have any tips for a lady wanting to wear a suit to a wedding? I don't have one yet, but I want to try it out. Also, there's a lot of potential triggers for this game, as our yes. mod Jamie has said. Yes. Uh, read them all. Read them, please. And if any of them, I will put the content warning up. Uh, sorry, Julia. It's okay. I'll have to adjust the volume like 27,000 times. Yeah, I'm going to go times. ahead and adjust it a bit just for safety. Safety strats. Um, first of all, you should find one that you feel confident in. I'm going back to the suit. It's not the trigger warnings. <laughs> yes. Uh, you should find a suit that you, first and foremost, feel good in. Um. I would suggest getting one that's not so bulky. I've noticed that I like the suits that aren't, that don't have like the shoulder pads or are of like a thinner material. Um, I really like suits like tuxedo. They're called like tuxedo blazers where the first button is lower than it would normally be. And it gives you that like slim line. We love a slim line. That slim long line to make you look longer. I would suggest a a tailor have it nicely tailored. You want to look like Slenderman, ideally. Yeah, Slenderman's got good fashion. Slenderman's so long. But really, just go with whatever makes you comfortable. You know, if you know if you're dreaming about doing a wilder suit, but you don't know how you do, start with like a more classic suit, one that necessarily wouldn't stand out too much on its own 
I guess. And then, you know, you can ease into other suits, I think. Always start with like a very base level to find your footing and then see what you like about it, see what you don't like. And then go off in there. Then you can go on with the little details. If you want to put some pizzazz in it, if it's got a little pocket, put a cool pocket square in it. That's of like a cool material. It's a lot of good advice. Zhuzh it up with a nice accent tie. It's a lot of, that's a lot of good advice. That's wear a, my wear advice. a bolo tie. Wear a bolo tie. That's or my advice. if you don't want to wear a tie, you can do like gold chains under the collar and then button the collar to the shirt so that it stays. Ugh really nice just got a little just got a little peep just that's a, a cool peep. look too little... get some of those collar pins Ooh. enamel pins you put on the on the collar that's yep. cool those are cool sometimes those have a chain that go between them and i love that my eye doctor recently had and i have worn it before where it's just like the the ribbon basically that you tie and it was black and it was long so it's like two rabbit ears and then the long extra fabric oh that's, that also looks really nice with the suit. So there you go. Gives it a, a you know, a, a feminine touch, quote unquote. I didn't expect us to start the stream with Fashion ten, advice? 10 full minutes of suit advice, but I hope that helped. You know, people ask, I will answer. How do I play this game? Got it. Uh, you're you're the little guy and the, the teacher will lean her head in and eat you. A lot. Yeah, that's what I know for sure. I'm trying to remember exactly where like we left off because like we got oh we went through the cafeteria where those the yeah the ruck, the raucous children yeah I where said the kids earlier. were going absolutely bazonkers in there and I loved it they were really freaking me out but because that stuff really freaks me out I don't like it when children are too <laughs> <laughs> I let go guys well, I let go well. You know? I let go of the the thing. It's uh that's one way to deal with it. We did get the can head too. Yeah. And if anyone gives me false tips for hats again, I'm going to wig out. We're gonna give you the false tip of getting banned from the channel forever. Yeah. Um, the game audio seems pretty low because there's literally almost no sound happening right now. It's very low for us. Um, the only thing, the only noises we hear are some children slamming in the background. The, the thing is when something happens, it gets a lot louder. So I'm waiting to see what the volume is like when something loud happens so that we don't like blow your ears out. But if it's still low, then, then I will adjust. What is this doing? What is this doing? You did it. You went back down. Have you gone through the door? Can you go through the door? No, I think it's too heavy. What did that open? I'm not sure. I think there's a puzz. There's a puzz here we have to do. Oh what did open? We got to do a little, little piece of puzz. I just didn't see anything. A little piece of puzz. You're right, a little piece of puzz. Maybe you gotta like hang something on the hook to like keep it down oh. so you can climb it. Like the brain. I don't, you probably can't lift the brain. Oh, you can lift that. Maybe you can lift the brain. You think you could put the brain on the hook? Uh oh. <laughs> <laughs> I uh, uh, press the wrong button. Uh oh. You threw yourself instead of the brain. Dang. Okay. Uh, uh, yep. Whoops. You're, now you're making a ruckus. You're just no better than those children in the other room. I am a child, probably. I don't know. What? What? <laughs> a little slippy. Oh, what? You did a little slippy. You just did a little slippy. That's oh, all. No. 
Nothing wrong with a little slippy. I did the exact same thing I did before. On a Saturday night. It's Sunday. It's always a Saturday night for me. Get out of my way, Jar. How many streams do you think it will be before the final person has come in and noticed that I dyed my hair for the first time? Always. Or always. Do you think it will always, be always now that it's become a I thing. I mean, I guess if you compare it to the number of people who just found out we're dating. Yeah. Then maybe it is always. Can I like throw it against the wall? So you can't. I don't see why you would be able to put it on the hook. Oh, can you get the brain out? And then put the brain on the hook. That's what I'm trying. I'm trying to smash it. That did it. <laughs> Julia, no. No. Oh, I lived. Oh. Yay. <laughs> Can I get it up there? Yeah, I don't know how you're going to get it up there, though. You can't climb with brain, right? Ew, it's so floppy. Come with me. It's your little brain baby. You'll see. Your little brain baby. Wow. That's really good. Do you think brain on hook is even the answer? I mean, I think so, because they're right next to each other. Throw it at the button? Oh, there is a button. I don't think I can throw that high, can I? Oh! Brain on hook's not even the answer. It was brain on button. Shh. Don't shush me. I'm so scared. This is the teacher we were talking about with the long neck. I know oh, her neck me. looks normal now, but I need you to trust me on this one. She's bad. It's not gonna be good. She's stressing me out. Do you think this was too soon? No, I think you did it. I think it's perfect. Flawless sneak. What's she chopping up there? Some ginger? <laughs> oh, God. Is she going to make a... Do you think it's too soon? Make some fried rice? Good sneak. I bet I don't see a way out that's not the d just the door. I mean, I think you have to go the way she went. Do you think she's going to come back? We can't hear her footsteps right now. I think we have to try. I think we have to go. What she got in these jars? Just, hand. just like stuff. There's like a hand over there. Jars of stuff. Jars of clay. Do you remember that band? I don't. Neither do I. <laughs> wow. But I remember that. I remember that it was a band. So, do with that information what you will. Oh God, it's one of these. Oh, you gotta sneak behind the jars. Stay in the shadow of jar. See, she knows you oh, gotta- she's making a boy! You gotta season the chicken the day before <laughs> and then put it in the fridge and give it time to absorb the salt throughout the meat. She knows. Oh, get in the shadows. Oh, safe. Shadow safe. Do you think you're going to have to do a big daring leap across? Mm-hmm. There's a foot in that jar. What you keeping the feet for, you nasty bee? What are you going to do with that? Is 
she's so busy with her jars. She doesn't even know you're here. Oh, good leap. Wow. Incredible. Incredible gameplay. You think she's about to come in? I feel like they would do that. They gave me a hiding spot? I'm gonna hide. She coming or she not coming? She coming or she not she coming? She too busy with her nasty little feet. I don't I don't think she's coming. Maybe something will fall off the cabinet and then I'll have to hide. Jazz Array said that's the first time they've seen anyone clear that part first try. Yay! <laughs> yeah! It makes up for all the other things I failed that I shouldn't have failed, like the tree. Through the hole, through the hole, and onward until morning. Oh, I thought, I I thought that killed you. I thought I died. I was about to be like, that's a little, a little poopy. I, that would have been a little poopy. That's a little poopy. Hammer. Time to murder a boy. Oh boy! Chad, get ready. Here comes the boy murder. Oh, that's the girl. Oh! <laughs> we did in fact murder a boy. We murdered ourselves. You murdered yourselves and a girl and another boy. So you need to activate it and then then get. Now hammer, now hammer. Oh, it's too slow, it's too mm. slow. Okay, so I think I gotta grab the hammer, go wide. Grab the hammer and then go wide, yeah. And then you can smack the boy. Come here, you little shit. No, I got him. You forgot the, the wrong button. button. You forgot the button. I thought it was square. Nice. Get ready. It's a girl. You know they're crafty. Keep your guard up. They could come from anywhere. It's a girl. Oh! oh! That timing's hard. Is there hats over here? No? Okay. All right, you got it. Just pretend you're playing Dark Souls. A game I'm famously very good you at. You didn't pretend you're playing Dark Souls. I just, I think I know the timing and then I don't, clearly. That's because you're not pretending you're playing Dark okay, you're Souls. Right. Go ahead and say some things you'd say if you were playing Dark Souls. This fucking blood priest Yankee. Yankee? <laughs> blood priest Yankee? <laughs> That's my Dark Souls name. <laughs> mm, this don't... fucking blood priest Yankee. <laughs> I don't trust this. Oh, oh you got taunted. Me. taunted. He taunted me. The taunt worked. It's because you notice when you were saying Dark Souls things, you were you were smashing and smashing. The instant you said nothing, you fell for the taunt. All right. Blood Priest Yankee Dog is first. You got to um, pretend that you are um, Motor Ed. I'm here for the. Channel Motor Ed and give them the box. You have to deliver the box. Yeah. Won't you take me to Bonking Town? Oh, won't you won't take you me to Bonking Town? Get wrecked. Bonk. Bonk one. That was way too late. You can't bonk at that pace. You really got to internalize the box. Okay. I'm feeling it. Feel the box. Live the box. Good bonk. Good bonk. Excellent work. 
Remember the box. You have boxed before and you will bonk again. Okay, don't fall for the taunt. You know he's gonna go eh, bleh, 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 bleh. Didn't help him that time. Didn't help him that time. Yep, yep, you read it. You read the moves. Excellent work. You're getting the sight. The sight beyond sight. Like the freaking Thundercat sword. I have the power. Of cats. What the heck? What the fuck you little gremlins doing? Is that a baby doll? Oh. oh. I was distracted by the baby doll. That's on me. Stop He's shaking your his butt, little butt. You little turd. Good box. Break it. Break oh, that's it. my friend. Oh, it's your little friend. Your friend is the baby doll. Oh, you probably got knocked out from... I got knocked out. Don't get up again. No, they're going to get up again. I'm really quite very dead. Oh, look, they do got a little face under there. You see that? Yeah. They got a little face. They've got a little face. You don't often get to see the little face. Come here. We're going. I got you. Now that you've rescued your friend from boy prison. Make them climb up themselves. Surprised we didn't kill the, the big neck lady. Uh-oh. There's still time. That would never break. It didn't break. Yeah, it would never. Hmm. <laughs> hmm. A perfectly normal piano. Attached as all pianos are to the ceiling. <laughs> if Wiley e. Coyote has taught me anything, it's that all pianos belong on winches. Yeah. Little friend, you better stand far away. You are strong to be able to lift this piano with that. Or we got a really good winch. With that crank. Friend? All that just so you could climb up on top of it. Is there a hat? Is there a hat? Please. Whoop. Yay! Yay! Whoa. Ray! You're gonna get in trouble. It's fun getting into trouble. I like that at this point, it's not even clear what your goal is. You literally just wrecked this piano through a floor because... Because it was of an no, option. Because of no reason, yeah. Oh, you weren't like escaping anything. Or she's supposed to boost me. Apparently our friend is a girl, according to chat. Our friend's a girl? I've been I've been they theming them. Cause I've seen no evidence in any Either direction. Either way. They have not said anything. I'm like a pronoun lawyer. Until I have hey, seen I don't trust this. evidence. Who are you? I will get it. I will give you a they them. Who are you and why is there a waste high wall here? Oh, okay, I had oh, the right idea. Piano I had distraction. Right, I had the right idea. Stealth attack. Bada bing! The devs say it? Well, you say the devs say it, but I haven't seen the devs say it. We're going with lawyer talk here. Until I've seen the devs say it. They get and they themed. <laughs> Coyote said, oh, to be two little guys holding hands. <laughs> Dude, trust me. <laughs> <laughs> I 
Okay, so we're back in the school, I say. Why does the school go across two buildings? School should be one building only. Whoa! Dang! They're hardcore! That's powerful. That's an ally. We kill. You know kill. I think they have some anger in them I, now. Well, yeah, they got freaking hung up by the ceiling by their feet. By these bad boys. Any hats over here? Was your high school multiple buildings? Kind of. We had this, um, we had this, like, front building that was really, like, a giant square, and then two breezeways on either side, and then a really tall building. That was four floors. Okay. So it, it was essentially multiple buildings? Yeah, essentially. We didn't refer to them as But you had breezeways. Buildings. Yeah. That's kind of what mine was like, too. I'm going to hold our friend's hand. But I do think it should have been one big building. I actually really liked the little... Because the little area between the breezeways and the buildings was this nice little, like, courtyard that we never went into. But you liked it. Yeah, there was, like... You could see it from the breezeways. It was this nice, like, tree and... This person's really practicing down on this one song. As you do when you're a musician, you gotta practice one part over and over again. I wouldn't know, I'm not really a musician. I mean, that is true, you do have to do that. I feel like they need to work on their dynamics. So far they're playing everything at a fortissimo. I'll show you fortissimo. Does that mean you're gonna scream at me? <laughs> I don't know what I said. <laughs> I don't know what fortissimo means. It means super loud. It means like strongly. Because, like, four in... Woo! No. How'd we end up back in a room where this teacher is? What if I just jump on her? I mean, it's not going to go well for you. Sup, bitch? Oh. Uh -oh. <laughs> <laughs> I thought I had for some reason thought of like a cool because she didn't see me right away. She didn't react. She was just like, what the? Then she just snapped you up. Oh, wait, there you are. Okay. She like turns around for no real reason, right? It's the same part of every song. I think she just turned around because you came in the room. I'm just making sure that she doesn't actually turn around. She also needs to probably play to a metronome because her tempo is, uh, is slipping a little bit in portions. I think it would really benefit her to set a metronome to a much lower speed and then practice at that speed until she can do it consistently and then slowly increase the speed. That's my take. <laughs> Although I guess she is writing the song as she plays, so. <laughs> Jacob mansplaining how to practice music. I can't mansplain to a fictional, horrible neck teacher. Because she won't listen like most women, am I right? 
so stressed right now. <laughs> I'm so stressed. I'm so stressed, and you're making jokes at the expense of women. <laughs> <laughs> I have to bring the thing. I'm thing. relieving the tension. I cancel Jacob again. <laughs> the problem. I'm having with this game is that I keep thinking that it's more of like a 2D, but it is a 3D space, but it's presenting it kind of 2D. Yeah, I've actually seen a lot of people say that that's an issue they have with the game as well. Like, I was moving that thing and I was expecting it to be like on a track. Yeah, that they forget to interact with it in a 3D space. Oh god, oh god, oh no, oh god. What the hell? He was just like not going in! You got stuck on the little latch. You gotta crouch, I think. There you go. Oh, that's so scary! That's so scary! That's genuinely so scary. Oh my god. That is incredibly unfortunate for everyone. Oh no, oh no, oh no. It can't go that far, it can't. What's the the main length? What's the, what's the max length? Women always sticking their necks out when it doesn't <laughs> belong. <laughs> God. This is our Andrew Dice Clay <laughs> routine that we're doing in the middle of our stream. God, that was genuinely really scary. <laughs> yeah, the lighting on her face was so good. <laughs> Cancel Julia. <laughs> we'll go down together. Yep. We always knew that would be the way. Cancelled for imitating someone who makes bad jokes. Yep. <clears throat> this is really cool though, this like visual here. Yeah. How many times do you think you're gonna fall in this pit? <laughs> don't. <laughs> A lot. <laughs> Can I even go over there? I don't think so. Bruno Ma Max said that joke was kind of a stretch. Hey! Nice one. There we go. This is the way I'm supposed to go. If anyone has any hat tips. Ooh, this is so cool. Yeah, this is great. This is basically how I used to do backgrounds is like getting it more like blunt. Like I would lower the opacity of whatever like the background was closest. Yeah with the background color by like 10% each time. So it would go back into atmospherics. Yeah, that's the atmospheric lighting. Yeah, it's, atmospheric, it's real what's easy it called? way There's to like a, Isn't there a phrase yeah, for it? Yeah, atmospheric lighting. Is it atmospheric lighting? No. I thought like specifically for when Is it, it like recedes depth? into the distance, there's like atmospheric a phrase. Atmospheric depth? Something like that? It's something like that. But I don't remember. Someone in chat will know, I'm sure. Oh, look at that cool dude. Atmospheric perspective. There we go, thank you. That's the one. Thank you, chat. Wait, is there a hat around this corner? What's that? Is that a little box of hat? This is a brick? Is that brick a hat? <laughs> Anything's a hat if you put it on your head. The chat is now full of atmospheric perspective. Of course. <laughs> oh, the brick stopped the dump. Yeah. Can I push this or do I need to? That's what it felt like when I was trying to go to the bathroom earlier. Hey. hey. 
What's, what's back here? Anything? Anything worth a damn? Uh, since people are asking to re-explain my sweater, it's actually a sweater that when I was a baby, what the hell? it's got my hand and my footprint on it. It was my grandmother's sweater, sweatshirt, and she gave it to me a while back and I forgot I had it. And, uh, so it's literally a 30 year old sweatshirt with my own baby foot and hand on it what the hell? that now I have grown into an adult and can wear, which I think is pretty neat. That is pretty neat. Oh. There we go. I gotta close the lid. Close the lid by pushing it in the little house. The little dumpster house. There we go. My friend. My friend, please. Solar Ace said, are atmospheric and perspective, dot, dot, dot. <laughs> <laughs> Come, little friend, do your finest leap. Your finest yakisoba pond, please. Jacob. I don't know if anyone in chats, in chats played 13 Sentinels, but... Hamburger, hamburger. Hamburger. We're at the very <gasps> end of it, and it's so good. Is this a hat? Is this a hat? Is this a hat? Oh, that looks like a hat. No, it's not a hat. It's not a hat. It's a little boat. But I want it as a hat. For my skull cap. Yes, I do. Where do I put this? Yeah, we're on like the last two characters to complete their story mm -hmm. in 13 sentinels so don't say any spoilers, no spoilers if you did play it we've got to finish goto and and hijiyama and then we're then we're done i'm so excited but i think about him borger every day yeah they can't be back they're not going back you can never go back I can't bring the boat, but I want to bring the boat. Look at the shoes sticking out of that dumpster. Bring the boat. Or Oscar's taking a nap. Oh. Is that a hat? No, it's a raincoat for a friend, I think. Because oh, the character in the first game wore the yellow They're going to look like the character now. That's where they got it. Oh my god. Wow, it's happening. The character from the first game is brutal. I'm glad that the character in this game is less brutal than the one in the first one. Well, it's the already one... been shown, I guess, that the character from the first game was even brutal now. Yeah. They've already shown some brutality. The character from the first game, like, eats living creatures. Sometimes. Sometimes is what you gotta do. I mean, she was starving. Oh, I hate this. That's a hat, but it's probably not for you. It's too big. But if ever there was going to be a hat location... It does seem like there would be a hat in here, right? A hat in this hat shop, yeah. No hat is too big. I'm so worried that we haven't killed the long neck lady. She'll be back. She's going to be back in a big way. That neck stretches all the way around town. Around the world, around the world. R.A.P. That funk. Hello, Olive. Hello. Wow, it took all of this long, huh? Hello. Well, let me get your little paw out of the way. <laughs> Atmospheric perspective. I like that. Surplex a lot. 
That was good. Hello. My mic got turned around, and I think it was because of Miss Olive. Whoops. Olive, did you turn my mic? <laughs> I was just looking at an old video of Olive. Fess up if you did. From the first time she ever asked for attention. And it's so cute. Oh no, is this gonna land directly in her gob? It did not. Is this a hat? <laughs> that would be really funny if her opened mouth was just there. Oh my God, are we back at the- What's your game plan? Are we back at the school? No, this is different. This is different. Around the school, around, around the, the school. school. Oh wait, isn't there a hat around here? Is that what someone said? Someone said that there was a hat like right outside the school, right? Where am I? There I am. The kitty's so pretty. Did you know the kitty's so pretty? There's a hat later, someone says. <clears throat> this is the hospital. This is the Hi. worst chapter. There are reports that this is the worst chapter. The worst chapter. The worst chapter. Oh, yeah, I guess R.I.P. Daft Punk, huh? Yeah. That's what I said earlier. I said it now. Self-defense. So we both said it now. She was just touching my head so slightly with her tail. It was kind of freaking me out. Olive's so pretty. Olive is so pretty. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. What do we think's going on in there? Hey, hey, Jacob. Oh. That reminds me of Grandma from Resident Evil 7. Hey, Grandma. Hey, Grandma. What you doing? Hey, speedrunner. <laughs> Grandma scared me so much in that game. And she never did anything other than be sitting places I didn't want her to be. Whoa. What is going on out here? This is no sort of way to run a hospital. Wow, our friend is Wow, ballsy. freaking mirror's edge over here. I thought this was the character from Little Nightmares 1, not the character from Mirror's Edge. I... <laughs> oh, you're fine. You're safe. I was just thinking about that Toad video. <laughs> there it is. And I did that thing. I did finish RE7 Mad Mod. I know she do stuff later. But she never does things as grandma. Other than sit there around. There was a person in that bed in the back. And it was scary. And I can't go back now. So you missed there it. There was a see? person in the bed. Do you see him? Yeah, they shouldn't be in that bed. I'm going to say it. I mean, I'm not a doctor. So I don't want to, you know, give oh, medical advice, but... I've got to carry this. It's like Crystal Chronicle. Yep. You ever play Crystal Chronicle? Nope. Well, then that's not going to mean anything to you, but it'll mean something to someone, won't it? Wow, you're not even that heavy. Well... This That's elevator a... is badly designed. Well, also, it's supposed to have more mechanisms on it to catch. And also, like, the counterweight's not even there. It's a... Well, you literally, like, what, like a few ounces? That elevator is not even an elevator. It's like a dumbbell waiter. It'd be like if even a, a dumbbell waiter has counterweight. It's like if a cat landed on it and it fell because of a cat. It's crazy. Oh, I hate this. No, this is good, I think. No. 
<laughs> I think this is good. Yeah, I really like this actually. Oh, <laughs> oh yeah. Oh no, I really like this actually. I really like this actually. <laughs> I think this is I actually love this. really good. This is cool and fun. I feel very comfortable. I think you have to use the light to see where you're going. Well, I know where I'm going. Yeah, but we're doing a, a internet stream. And people might also want to see where you're going. Well, I don't want to get got. But you don't even know what's going to come get you yet. I know something's going to go, go, go and get me. It's not. I'm telling you, this is fine. Oh, it's a uh, ketchup. Mm. This is totally normal. <laughs> Sometimes I think about that song and I'm like, why did someone write this? I don't know, but they're flipping genius because it has made a bajillion and a half dollars, probably. But, like, do you ever think about how, like, when you sit down to write something, you're like, I really want this to be good and, like, mean something. And, like, I'm really, you know, putting my thought into it. And meanwhile, some dude was just out there like, hey, uh, she's wearing a, a itsy bitsy little bikini. Itsy bitsy teeny weeny what yellow if I just, bikini. What if I just wrote that down and then sang it? And I don't even care. And I'll make a million dollars. Yeah, and that's why that man's going to be more famous than I'll ever be. Isn't that messed up? Yeah. The sound is still on. There's just no sound happening. This seems like a cool room. Do you think there's a drink I can get? Do you want that? This is um, you playing that VR exorcist game all over again. <laughs> eh, the liberals. Liberals with the, the soda pops. Is that a tab soda? That's how you know they're in hell. They only have tab. I have nothing against tab. Have you ever had tab? Yeah, I've had tab. Yeah. It's just like a soda. I don't know. I feel like I wouldn't be able to tell in a taste test. Yeah. I just feel like everyone makes fun of tab, or at least they used to. Uh oh. There's a, a a leg or a boot over there. A boot. There's a boot. A boot. <laughs> this is the problem for my skull brain. Skull brain. <laughs> what is going on in here? I guess last time you tried to go into the TV, right? Yeah, and then our friend pulled us back. It's like commentary about how we live in a society that like values TVs over like the elderly. Like if Damn. we just Damn Like if we just visited our elderly, they won't have to be stuck in front oh of these TVs. Oh my god. You're blowing my gourd right now. I was using the wrong joystick for that entire thing. You're smashing my pumpkin right now. I'm really grateful and you're dead. You <laughs> <laughs> that was terrible. <laughs> you can do it. Tune it in. Tune it in. I did it. Gratefully, you're dead. <laughs> run to the door. Won't you run to the door? Oh, 
Oh man, I really panicked at the disco. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody in chat literally said that at the exact Damn. same time you said it. All right. Nokia kiosk worker, uh, I know there's like delay on stream, but I want you to know that your message popped up at the exact instant Julia said that. And that's pretty amazing to me. Same brain. I'm sorry. I'm digging this like atmospheric music. Little music for you. Little X ray for you. You your should, finest hat, please. You should x ray your friend just as like a joke, as like a little goof. Oh. What's going on? You weren't looking. Did the bear do something? Yeah, the bear does stuff. That bear's not doing anything. You sure about that? The bear's just sitting there. Look at his little feetsies, Jacob. You ready? That bear's not doing anything. It's wiggling his little feet. <clears throat> You're bumping the table with your head. Teddy bear hat on the right bookshelf. I saw it in chat. Do not miss this golden opportunity for a, a teddy hat. I don't know where it is. Oh, is it up on top? Yeah, I couldn't get up there. Oh, teddy hat. Oh, teddy hat. That's a nasty one. That's not a nasty teddy. <laughs> oh, 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 What's going on here? Hey. I'm a bear. Yeah, cause she's better in the tin can. I'm a little why bear you, child. Why are you holding that, sweetie? Because they know something you don't know. Oh fuck! <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead. Is that a Kermit? Is that a Kermit? Kermit hat. Hey Kermit. I don't think it's a Kermit. Cerulean Char said, I don't think you're ready for this teddy. <laughs> I don't think you're ready for this teddy. X-ray it. There's something inside. A knife? A spoon? What is it? So how do we get it open? I know that the teddy bear has a key in it, it seems like. Who's got a teddy key? Well, there's a teddy on the on the thing. Get the Ted. That Ted's not gonna... Oh my god, I was completely wrong. I thought that was gonna be unpick upable. And here we are. But it was exceptionally pick upable, turns out. All right, blast the teddy. Nothing. Is that the key that's in the thing that she's holding? Well, I, I don't know what to do with it. Do we just carry it back to the- Bring the other teddy. Teddy two. This one? The yeah. rabbit? Yeah. Teddy Rabbit. It's going to be inside Teddy Rabbit. Everyone was very ready for the Teddy to have bones. I was very ready for the Teddy to have bones. Are you like in and out? Oh, well, she made a noise, or the rabbit made a noise. What's in the rab? There's a key. Good. 
So I guess we need we need to that key it. for something. Yeah, we need to open it. Let's bring it with us. Bring it with us along our journey. It's your new friend. Now you're a party of three. Four. Excuse you. Oh, I forgot about the little... Is it a one of them clanging monkeys? Yeah. Oh, she dropped it and then kicked it. <laughs> Should I be dropping mine? No, you have things to do. Were there scissors? Someone said that there were scissors. Scissors. I thought I saw scissors earlier, but I couldn't remember where it was, and I thought it was just decoration. But I should have known. People are saying the elevator. And you bring it with you. Down you go! Straight down to hell. This is a good hospital. I really trust this place. I just feel like everyone's really well taken care of. Yeah, look at how many toys they have. Yeah, I mean, how many hospitals do you go to where you see enough toys? <laughs> Chuck them through. Oh, you're gonna have to incinerate it. Because there was a lever and this is an incinerator. I hated the lighting. RIP. <laughs> R.I.P. new friend, sorry. We only knew you for a short time, but unfortunately we do have to incinerate you entirely to get the key out of your body. It's not our fault. Someone put a key in them. Someone messed that up before us. I mean, we can't go in there right now. It's still hot. Know that your sacrifice was not in vain. Know that your sacrifice was not in vain, probably. This doesn't feel like any place in Maine I've been to. You don't think this takes place in Maine? No. So that crosses one location off our list. Yeah. But we still got, you know, it's definitely in the States. I'll say that. Mm -hmm. No, I think it's in foggy London town. You think it's in foggy London town? I mean, look how foggy it is. And then you got the school from Pink Floyd songs. Do we want to explore what's upstairs first before we go anywhere else? Because there was that key all the way back that we could use. I mean, the lock all the way back. I think you should do whatever you want to. Uh, it probably goes to that locked door, huh? Yeah, there's a pretty obvious locked door there, I'd say. Someone oh, asked, there's a lot of limbs in here. Someone said, well, if you had to pay for the x-rays, it's probably America. And, you know, we won't know if we have to pay for the x-ray until like seven months from now that we even forgot we had an x-ray. Yeah. And then the bill comes in for $200,000 and your entire life is ruined. And you've forgotten if you've had half of the tests that they're billing you for because it was seven months ago. It's mannequin limbs. Hey, if I break a leg, I know where to get another one. Hey. Hey. If I want to run faster, there's longer legs here. So I must oh. be in Taylor Swift's house because there's so many long legs at Taylor Swift's house. Sometimes I worry about the way you structure jokes. <laughs> <laughs> Because I think it gives like an insight into your mind and I'm scared. That it just goes and I don't get to stop it at any point. You can't stop this train once it starts going. I hate that that's tied down. I'll say it. Yeah, I also don't like it. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no, the arm went away. The arm went away. The arm just cousin it it away. A hand. Oh, Julia, you did it. <laughs> you did it. I'm so proud of you. 
<laughs> oh, that actually gave me chills. The joke you made? Yeah, my joke was just that good. No, the fact that I didn't know where to hide from that hand. No one can hide from the claw. Now, I feel like if we're in a situation where all the limbs here can move, then it's just a truly untenable situation for everyone involved because there's so many limbs. Imagine if they all started wiggle jiggling at once. You're like, oh, I almost got the... Olive's hitting you with her tail. <laughs> what? Oh, what do you want? She keeps hitting me. She's hitting me in the face. She's smacking you with it. She just smacked me in the face. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on. It's extra atmospherics for the game. It's like a little, like something creeping up behind you. It's, it's like that a little hand. hand. Yeah. What do you want? It's a little hand creeping up. <laughs> what do you want? Why do you keep smacking me? You getting, you getting upset? You getting testy? Huh? Do you have something you want to say to me? Okay. Okay. Back to it. I'm so scared. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, I hate it so much. It's really bad. Oh, it's really bad. Go. Crouch. Crouch. You weren't fast enough because you didn't crouch. You gotta remember to crouch. Oh! Alright, I got this now. I'm focusing. Speed demon. Speedrun strats. You gotta be the speedrunner. Go so fast. Go so fast. Yes. Excellent work, Julia. What do you think's going on in here? What do you think's making that noise? The hand in the vent. Oh no! Oh no, it's the hand! Oh god, it's back! Oh no! That's bad. That is That's bad. bad. I don't like that. Do I have to hide? But there's nowhere to really hide. <laughs> okay. Oh, get it in the clamp. Catch it in the clamp. I mean, I can try, but... There's like... It really feels like you gotta catch it in the clamp. Right? Because the light's on it? Doesn't seem to want to go up there, huh? That noise is so bad. Okay, so... Can't go there. All right, we're just gonna have to explore. Yeah, we're gonna have to figure it out. Nope. Oh my God, you don't have enough ops. Or you're just not jumping at it right. I'm not sure which one, yeah. Mm. Olive, could you stop? She doesn't know what she's doing. She keeps looking at me like, what? It moves exactly like the tarantula in Animal Crossing. <laughs> it does. Except it's not as scary as the tarantula in Animal Crossing. Which is the scariest horror monster of all time. Alright, Jukes. 
Jukes and jumps. That's what we got to work on here. Can you just like go on through? That's my plan. Hey, no problem. Oh, could not jump out of there. Oh, it's here. Hammer. Hammer time. Oh, I'm flawless with oh, the hammer. Oh, no, it dodged. Oh, nice. Oh, you got to get it again. It's a boss. It's a boss fight. Come on, fucko. Oh, it jumped. Nice. Okay. I love how his hand moves. One more. Zelda rules. Yeah! Nice! I think you got it. You I got an achievement for hitting it multiple times. You did get an achievement for hitting it. I just All wanted right, nice to make work. sure. And you got your little, your little light, your little light friend. I gotta say, I'm impressed so far with this game and the amount of like unique, yeah, uh, frightening threats they've managed to generate so far. Yeah, that was a big draw with the first game as well. Can I just like? I probably need the hammer. Break on through to the other side. I'm watching you, motherfucker. Break on through to the other side. I hear more noises. To my left. Nice. Break things. Break things. It's punk rock. <clears throat> uh oh. You okay there, bud? I'm genuinely concerned regarding. Do you want to talk about it? Also, are they bigger? Did they get bigger? Or are they just standing a little more aggressively? Do you want to talk about it a little bit? Or do you want to leave it alone? Do you think this game ends with your little friend murdering you? <laughs> I mean, I know that this character you're playing is not in yeah. the first game, right? Yeah, I feel like we definitely die. I don't know if it's because they kill us. Is it, um, ad time? Is it a time for an <sighs> ad break? Yeah. I drank water really bad and spilled it on my face. Which means it's time for an ad. I should take that plug and put it in that door. And then ad? And then ad. I agree that. I agree that. <laughs> I agree that. No. I don't want that either. Game? Game? Yep, I want that. Can you... I don't even know what you're doing. Uh, while you were spilling water on your face. Yeah. Uh, in a sort of and we airplane all... drinking problem sort of joke. <laughs> we all agree that it was I worth found the time it took me to do and then talk about. This gated door, which requires a plug. Plug it. Plug it and plug it in. Whee! Corn! Do you want to do the ads? Corn. Do you want to do the ads? Yeah. We're going to do... Three minutes of ads. <laughs> Sorry. I immediately went to this cam and Olive, Olive just had her back in. leg like all the way up. Uh, three minutes of ads. Uh, do some water. Eat uh, some meds. Drink some food. Um, stretch. Stretch. It's happening. It's happening. The ads, they are running. And Olive, she is cleaning. Hi. Hi, Miss Olive. 
Oh, the stretch. The perfect stretch. She doesn't stretch out much. She stretches a little bit. Bye. She doesn't always have to stretch to the no. maximum amount. She can stretch just a little bit. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's whose 30th birthday today? Who's I saw 30th a 30th birthday. birthday. All hail Korok. This is their 30th birthday today. They said, oh. I wanted to th say thanks for being awesome and making me genuinely excited for my third decade of life. I want to be you when I grow up. Hmm. That's very sweet. I'm not that much older than you. Yeah. Well, I mean, I'm 31 and we're both 31. I'm going to be 32 in two weeks. Yeah. I think so far being in 30s has been, it's been great. I mean, other than the whole like world Personal life, <laughs> per been great. the whole world situation, but personally, yeah, I think I'm happier at 30 and 31 than I was at 20 and 21. Oh, that's for sure. So that's good. We love that. I was in a, I was in a bad place. <laughs> well, not that bad, relatively. It wasn't I mean, that when bad. I was 20 and 21, everything was very confusing. Yes. And I didn't know that anything about true. what I was doing. I was very scared about the future, as I am today. So nothing has changed. The Ides of March is my birthday. I wish. Ides of March, my favorite holiday, not holiday. Not even a joke. Um, but my birthday is March 12th. I was supposed to be born on St. Patrick's Day, which would have been ironic. <laughs> It's your favorite holiday. Oh, it's my favorite. I love it. It brings you love out the it. best in everyone. For everyone who is uh, 18 to 23 mm -hmm. in the chat, mm -hmm. know that I feel you. Yes. But we made it through. You'll make it through. Yeah. And I can promise you that by the time you're 30, nothing will have gone the way you thought it was going to go when you were 18. And... That's and that will probably be, for the better. And it will probably be for the better or it will be fine. Yes. No matter Just what try happens, it'll probably be Just fine. Just do your best. Yeah. I feel like I know nobody who like I was friends with at or still am friends with, but like that I knew when we were twenty mm -hmm. that is now in a place that they predicted they would be then. Yeah. Yeah. I had very different plans for where I would be when I was thirty one. In a lot of ways. Um, yeah, it's weird. It's weird and uh, you can't predict it. And you sometimes think you have a plan that's perfect for you. But then stuff will happen and you're like, actually, this is pretty okay. And you usually come around on that when you're in your 30s, I'd say. Big stretch. That's my olive did a big stretch noise. Somebody... <laughs> Ow. Ow. You had your claws out and you landed on my back. I saw something that made me laugh. Just wanted to see it again. It was Ray97 said, I wanted to be a scientist when I was 18. Now I'm 24 and work for a circus school. <laughs> That's Which is phenomenal. Truly the opposite of a scientist in the best ways that's I, that's very cool i feel like every decade of my life i've had a different idea of what i thought i would be or like every five years probably i have a different idea of what i thought i would want to do or or where i thought i would be in five years the is point is you shouldn't have a five-year plan it's pointless <laughs> i mean you should aim for a general goal yeah, have a goal, but don't be like, if I'm not here in five years, I failed. Because you, yeah. won't, you won't be. You won't be. <laughs> You'll be somewhere else. And that's fine. That's life, baby. Um, it just does stuff, and you have to deal with it. Basically, the only thing you should try to do is make sure that you are in a physically, or work towards being in a physically and mentally good place. Having uh, some savings, if you can manage it, and... Um, let everything else flow around you. Those are the three things you should focus on. Oh, and being, you know, happy. But that goes with the mental health yeah. thing. With the good mental health. I just saw that Roomful of Lesbians said they were moving across the country to NYC for school on Thursday. It's such a weird experience. I'll say welcome. Welcome. You're entering New York in a weird time, but it is my favorite city in the world. 
it's the best place. If it's a place that you that vibes with you and mm-hmm. you vibe with, then you'll you'll adore it. But you'll also, find a corner for you. Um, you'll only adore it once it opens back up again. But once that <laughs> happens, yeah, it's it's truly the best. I and love it'll it be here. a lot in the beginning. I will warn you. I've never had an a lot in the beginning uh, because I was uh, born in it, but. I think for everyone, the first like year or two is chaos and they're not used to our pace or they're not used to everyone being verbally friendly. But New Yorkers take care of New Yorkers. Um, the city won't, but that's why New Yorkers take care of New Yorkers. <laughs> I genuinely love this city so much. I hate Midtown, but I love this city. Yeah, but most other places are rad. Have you been to every city? <laughs> Not I've, quite. I'm, you know, missing a couple cities. I've been to, uh, as for major cities, Salt Lake City, Chicago, San Francisco, L.A., uh, Seattle, Paris, London, Oxford, Edinburgh, or Edinburgh, or. So don't worry about it. Just keep talking. Whatever. Every time I say Edinburgh, just keep going. Like, oh. Just keep going. Barrel through. Dublin. A bunch of cities in Australia. I mean, not Australia. Austria and Germany that I can't remember off the top of my head. Tokyo. I have some other Kyoto, things I want. I know you're listing cities, but I have some Vermont, things I want to talk about. Vermont. I know you've been to a lot of cities. <laughs> Uh, somebody asked, or Trigger Mort asked, how ethnically diverse is NYC? M- very. I mean, it's one of like the m- most multicultural cities. New York, Queens itself has the most cultures represented in an area in the world. Yeah. We have, if you are looking for diversity, New York has it. Queens, you will find every pocket in Queens. It's truly amazing. Yeah, there's places you can go everywhere in New York City where you can experience basically any culture. That was like, that's an actual statistic. There are like the most cultures represented in uh, one city is, or like one area is Queens, Queens, New York. It's uh, awesome. Somebody else had asked me specifically if, if New York was um, friendly like the South, but less racist. <laughs> um, I, I would not describe it as friendly like the South. It's a different type of thing. Mm. Uh, the South is very like friendly in the sense of like externally people are very friendly. Um, in New York, externally people are very uh, stoic because mm-hmm. there's just too many people here. Like you can't speak to everyone it's not it's not feasible you got to move on um so people are very like short with you externally but when it comes to actually like needing help or something then people will turn up for you yeah yeah the the south has kind of like a a fake friendliness vibe which is nice but doesn't go below the surface i think new yorkers are friendly inside of themselves i found i saw a thing recently that was like new york it was like comparing the friendliness of New York versus other places and New York's friendliness is like no one will say anything to you but someone will help you. If you have a stroller and you're in front of the stairs, someone's going to grab it and walk up with you and yeah. just like look at you and be like we're going. Yeah. They no won't, discussion. They won't even Let's take their go. headphones off. They won't even take their headphones <laughs> off. It's just like this is what is the right thing to do. We're going to help you carry this up. So they'll help you carry your stroller. You know, if it was just like that's how it was described instead of making like a big deal about helping people just do it people just do it because everyone's in a rush and that's just what you have to do and and that's just the right thing to do so you're just gonna move things along a little bit yeah we should Um, uh get back in the game yeah because i know ads are done ads are done gameplay all right i don't know if i'm ready to go back to spooky town I'm playing with a controller. Grab my corn. That's red.
Can I put the corn in? I don't think you can put the corn in. I don't think this is a corn powered. Uh -oh's. oh, but it has the thing that I need. I do want to say too, just uh, that a lot of people really hate New York City and they're also correct to feel that way about it. Yes. Here's, you go to Midtown or you go to Manhattan, you're probably gonna hate it. You go to, I don't know. Can you like, yeah. Can you open the, th can you open the thing? Can you open the thing so like I can go in? Well, I think generally it's, it's also just like, uh, a nasty, uh, trashy shit town. Yes. And if you're not yes. okay with it being a nasty, trashy shit town, then... New York City is a city that barely works, and it only works because people are goddamn stubborn and love it, despite the fact that it's so freaking busted. Anyways, that's it. That's all the New York talk. I just feel passionately about it because I was a person that thought I hated New York City <gasps> until I lived here. And then I was like, oh, <gasps> actually, I love it. Yeah. What's the problem? That's It's a hospital, Julia. Patients are allowed to be here. You're the one who's an intruder. I think this is fine. I think this is good. I think this is good. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Is this like a red light, green light situation? So if you turn the light off, it's going to move. Yes. That's why I'm holding the flashlight. But I bet on you have right to get now. like where it is, right? Yeah but I also don't want it to flip and kill me. Oh my God, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. Oh, 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 no. That's so scary. That's so scary. I want you to know it took my character like a full second to click the button after I clicked it. So I was like, no, I turned the flashlight on. It's probably fine. It's probably fine. It's fine. It's fine. Christ, turn it on. <laughs> oh, I didn't think it was going to move that fast. Well, because it starts all hobbly. <sighs> I don't know how much more of this game I can take. Will she? You played the first one, right? Yeah. It's still a goddamn mystery as to how. Because you're very powerful. I am not. That is such a lie. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> In this house, we support Julia Lepetit. And you have to as well, or else you have to move out. And I will support you alone without you. <laughs> oh, I gotta go that way. <laughs> I feel like there's some kind of metaphor in there for society. Oh, he got a little butt. Look at his little butt. <laughs> nice, nice cheeks, buddy. Oh, fuck. Which one of you wow, is there's so many. gonna come alive? That one. And that one. Oh, this is bad. Oh, this is bad. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, not this I, is bad. Not if I don't juke him. I love that this is literally just the mechanic of, like, booze from Mario. I see you, motherfucker. <laughs> it's so funny with the teddy bear. Yeah, the teddy bear adds really good. He has hook hands. 
hook sorry. hand, door, car, hand. Can we go back to talking about New York? So the reason that people like Did New York Did you say York honking is, about New York? Is the people in New York from honk, not the city. Honk. Honk. My hands are so sweaty. Honk. Uh, <clears throat> okay. Okay. <laughs> Somebody just said my lizard just shit on me. Thanks, Jacob. <laughs> You're why welcome. That, why is that your? Oh. Oh. Oh no. Oh. Oh. Oh dang. Oh, da oh dang. Oh beans. I went all the way back here. I thought it would checkpoint me under the bed. Speeder on strats. Speed run strats, run straight for the bed. They won't be able to get you in time. You think so? Yeah. I do think so. Listen, it worked. Only because I'm <laughs> fucking good. <laughs> it worked. It was perfect. I see you. I'm onto your shenanigans, oh. you little shit. Your shenanigans. Oh my god. This is so cool, though. I see you all, motherfucker! Put in the spotlight! What, you thought you could you make a fucking move? Are you stuck in a corner right now? Huh? You thought you could make a fucking move? I think you stuck yourself in a corner. No. I think you were in the bad zone now. No. No, I'm not. Get him, get him, get him. Uh, I couldn't get get him, both. get him. Speed run strats. Speed hey, speedrunner! Hey, speedrunner! What if you like 360 the flashlight while you run? <laughs> <laughs> I, I don't move that fast. Oh, dang. I was hoping you could just like spin like this as you went. That's what I would do. What the fuck you want, huh? Step off! <laughs> I'm watching you! Watching you creepy motherfuckers. Yeah? What you think about this? What you think about this, huh? Ain't this some cool shit? Don't don't you dare. Don't you dare. Cause I gotta turn around and I gotta go in as Go, go, go. Oh, there's just more, huh? There's just Suck more. It. Don't you twitch a hand at me, I see you. Did you move? If you move, I'm gonna get you with my flashlight. This flashlight better not run out of batteries. Oh, I hate you. No offense, sir. Yeah, let's just go ahead and jump on through the vents. Definitely nothing like a hand in here. We belong. We belong to the Who ruined the shitter? Who did the turlet? Who did the turlet? Who did this? Huh? Why why do mannequins even got a shit? Who programmed shitting into the mannequins? Was it the teacher? Someone did it. Do you remember those like baby dolls that like shitted? Yeah, and pissed? I thought that was a good idea. You like my cheese? What a hysterical toy. <laughs> they want the cheese. You want the cheese, <clears throat> you want the cheese, you want the cheese. Yeah, I got the cheese. <laughs> wow. Okay. Wow. All right. Like, could y'all just calm down? Everyone. Just like a wee bit. It's just cheese. All right. Like, okay. I I know where we are now. We're in France. Oh! oh. Drop the cheese! Oh no! <laughs> <laughs> they want the cheese. They want it. <laughs> they need the cheese. Is there a hat back here? 
<laughs> Sir Flex a lot said me and the homies after we get the vaccine. <laughs> What's this way? What's this way? Is there a hat back here? Uh, You're not a hat. What is that? You found a digital... Oh, the cheese! Put the cheese in the rat hole. Put the cheese in the rat hole. Why'd you find like a digital baby? We keep finding those, remember? What does the digital baby do for you? I don't know, but then uh, the TVs get us. I'm telling you, we live in a society. When real, when digital baby, more important than real baby, that's how you know the liberals have won. Can you reward me for feeding you? Like with a hat? Do y'all have like a like a hat that I could have? Can you jump down there now? Well, probably not. Well, you gave them cheese, so they're full. Okay, we can try it. I think that's the sound of them greeting me peacefully. Yeah, you join their society. Oh, the cheese is gone. Yeah, I wonder if there's more cheese. Some people think there's more cheese. They suspect. Hmm. Well, I don't see any cheese in here. And let me tell you, Apparently, this direction... there's no hat for a while. What's even the point? <laughs> Someone said baguette? Uh -huh. No, these are arms. Those are arms. Arms is not baguette. There was a baguette in there. Where? Where? That's an arm. That's an arm. That's a shirt. In rat room. In rat room? Baguette in rat room? Rat row. You can't have baguettes in the rat room. You got to keep... Your rats and your baguettes. Is it in the corner That's a there? Foot. Go left corner. Is that a baguette? This looks like a brick. Or is that a briquette? Do they want it? They don't want it. They don't like that. <laughs> you want this can? No, they don't like that either. There was no baguette in the rat room. Is that it? Did I do the thing? Was it all for an achieva? <clears throat> Maybe it's just chivo. They're saying the bread is still there. Is it bread in the corner or is it a brick? It's a brick! I'm pretty sure that's a brick. Y'all? <clears throat> it's a brick, chat. It's not bread. Oh Next God. to the spoon? Gonna... That's a foot. That's a foot. We threw the foot <laughs> in. <laughs> Y'all, this it's a foot. <laughs> is a foot. <laughs> foot or baguette. If you can't tell the difference between bread, bricks, and feet, then we got problems. You're gonna have a lot of difficulties in life. I realize that there is an Italian loaf named after a slipper, but y'all, there's a difference. <laughs> you have got to go back in your homes. I'm tired of these shenanigans. All right, get ready to blast the crawlers. Nice blat. You turned. You, 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 no, you turned away. Awesome. You turned away. You turned your back on a crawler. Well, now I don't have to spend twenty minutes at the rat hole debating foot or bread. <laughs> <laughs> 
Yeah, I was just down at the rat hole with the boys <laughs> debating foot or bread, you know. Classic it's the, discussion. It's the new, uh, blue and black, gold and white. It's the new the dress. Is it foot or bread? All right, keep him, keep him on blast. Keep him on blast. I disappeared. <laughs> I disappeared from the body. It's because the game couldn't even comprehend how you didn't keep him on blast. It's hard because he's very floaty. Well, like, listen, you got to consider that I'm not controlling the game. Do you see this? So I can just assume that this whenever- This is me in a circle. I can assume that whenever a mistake is made, <laughs> it's completely your fault. And the game controls perfectly, because I've never controlled it. All right, remember to put him on blast. See? Blast. Maintain blast. Blast mode. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. Do you see how he like moves? I just assume that's you doing that. No. He. That was him moving by himself. I just thought then... you were doing that for no reason. You gotta be Beelzem on blast mode. What is that noise behind me? Olive is scratching the uh, cat bed. <laughs> God. I love this cat. Does anyone want this? Clean up your act. Is that bread or is that soap? This is soap. Are we sure? <laughs> chat, vote chat, now. What, chat, what do you think? Bread, bread soap. or soap? Bread or soap, chat. We got to know. We need a poll. Run a poll. Do we feed this to the rats? What's back here? It could be shower bread. Sometimes you get hungry in the shower. What's in here? It, it happens to everyone. I don't like this noise. Oh, I'm hearing. Oh, it's another digital baby. This is the future liberals want. These liberals, they were not having real kids. They just having Tomigachi <laughs> babies. Tomigachi babies. To Tomigachi babies. To praise them for taking a bath. Oh, do a little poo poo. Just press a button, wave your hand, it's all gone. <laughs> just like the wizards in Hogwarts. <laughs> they just do a poo poo, <laughs> raise their wands, and disappear. <laughs> I'm gonna make a web comic about it. Oh, bread won the poll. Turns out it's bread. You can tell by how it slides along the ground. <laughs> that was in a shower room. Like bread. That guy is strapped into that tub and that's how I want to die. <laughs> You'd be so happy. You'd be like, sorry, can't leave. What am I supposed to do? Strapped into the tub. You knew you couldn't make that leap. But you tried. And God bless you. <laughs> Throw soap into tub. <laughs> Let's get them clean. All right. Soap them up. Hold on. Let's try it. See what happens. This is the problem. They left all the soap in the soap box. Didn't bring it into the tub. Miss. Miss. Okay, a little bit closer. I feel like this game would actually be cool to play in VR. Nice! What do you mean it would be cool to play in VR, Jake? Because, like, you could perceive the depth of the space. You know what I mean? 
Oh, he, yeah, that's definitely what I want. Well, then you like it would make the platforming easier. Because you could perceive the depth of the space. Soapbox. Sometimes I feel like you don't really consider the ramifications of seeing the depth of the space. <laughs> You're right. Will this help? Soapbox. Get on your soapbox. Get on your soapbox. I think that... <laughs> Uh, women don't do enough work in the workplace, and that's why they shouldn't be allowed to work in the first place. <laughs> it almost kind of rhymed. It rhymes. Uh, it's it's very clever. Can I take this one? Is there a point to this? Can you use it to jump up on the thing? <clears throat> mm. Were you trying to use the force? <laughs> No, I was trying to open that grate that's in the floor. Turn off lights. Are you insane? <laughs> Are you crazy? I mean, I think you're right. Is that a Hamilton reference? I've never seen Hamilton in my goddamn life. Whoa. I don't know why Julia got so aggressive about that. <laughs> <laughs> How fucking dare you? <laughs> I saw something recently. It was just like, "Oh, hi, Olive." It was a very basic sentence, and someone responded to it with, "Is that a Hamilton reference?" And I was like, "What fucking part?" <laughs> it was like, "Do you want to go? Like, do you need bread?" And someone was like, "Is that a Hamilton reference?" And I was like, "What part? Why? No, that's a normal sentence." <laughs> I was so annoyed. Well, we were playing Thirteen Sentinels, and oh, I fuck you. I did ask if Miura was making a Hamilton reference when he said, "I'm not." I'm not throwing away my shot. Yeah. Because I've never seen Hamilton, but I do know they say that in Hamilton. Olive! I didn't actually mean to be upset about that, and I'm not actually upset about that. I just thought it would be funny if I reacted aggressively. Sometimes it's fun. Sometimes it's funny. Sometimes it's funny. To be angry over nothing. Sometimes it's funny to put on a little show. It's a bit. It's a bit. Don't you get it? It's a bit. I hate this room. Everything's dark. All of it was you that messed up my mic last time with your tail. What did she do? She hits it with her tail when she's trying to. She hits everything with her tail, including my face. My eyeballs. Why haven't meow, I seen Hamilton? Because it meow, costs meow. like seven thousand million dollars. I'm playing the olive piano. I don't give a dizzy my money. Fuck! I hate this. Here she goes. Ugh, I'm Jacob. <laughs> I'm running. Look how fast I am. Whoa! I'm gonna go run a marathon. A speedrunner! A speedrunner! Oh, fuck. No, 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 no! Everyone, fuck off! That's too many in there, I think. Too many in there? What am I supposed to do? Just a wee light! Can you turn the lights back on? Turn the lights on. I did. This is a different room. Yeah, I didn't know if the lights were for this room, too. But it turns out you can't even go back. You should turn on the lights in your brain. Oh, no! I've been insulted. 360, no. no scope. I don't know how you're supposed to get through this room. I have no idea. Just keep spinning. Get every single one as I go. Am I just supposed to run? Let's try just running. You're going to get absolutely grabbed. Oh, absolutely. Yeah. It's faster than ever before. All right, what's your strat? What's Patience. your ga gamer strat? Be patient. Patience and hope that my character uh, aims at everyone without me having to tell him to. <laughs> I don't think I would have 360 there if I were you. Literally, I was walking <laughs> and I pointed the joystick down because the guy's closer to me and my character was like... Listen, I'm hearing a lot of excuses right now. And what I want to hear is results. <clears throat> we got to get these success numbers up by EOD. By EOS, end of stream. 
or else the kids, they're not gonna watch. Unless you're a, a professional gamer. You're doing really good. Whoa. You're doing, you're doing excellent. You gotta be like Ninja Fortnite. Ah! You're the Ninja Fortnite of Little Nightmares 2. You know, it's always what I've said, but... The people, they've disagreed with me. Nice job. Thank you. What, um... What's going on in here? Oh, there's water on the floor. Electroshock. Hup. Nice. Yeah. Can you... Now your friend will let you out. Oh, yeah, you will. Nice. Do you think your little friend, like, saw you go off and was like, they're never coming back? That's the last time I see that person. Yeah, I think so. I think that is what they thought. Now give me this. Give me this shit. Give it. Are you going to put it in the main door now? Yeah. With the other one? Yeah. Wow. Well, not the other one, but I can take that one out, I guess, and put it in the yeah, elevator door. Yeah, you could door. do two. You could do two. I can't open the goddamn door. If this were in VR, open the goddamn you could door. perceive the depth of the space. Open the goddamn door. Why does no. nobody consider perceiving the depth of the space? Wee! That was my victory jump. You did good. Ugh. I really had to, to hold whole brain that that spooky room well, you, I had to zone out of stream mode enter of out of entertaining mode shut down all facilities and all brain power to whip it around with flashlight yeah that's what I did you did I don't like this I'm seeing a major body horror warning from Starling art coming up in this next section so if you don't want to see major body horror, my favorite military leader, then yes. then tune away. Tune away now. I don't know enough of that song to sing it as a reference. You tried. That was cool. I do like the song water though. I think it's a lot of fun. Oh, I hate that noise. Here we go. You know what I like to imagine for fun? What do you like to imagine for fun? If instead of this character you were a little Mario <laughs> and you were running around this world going, wah! Waha! It's just a constant. Oh no! <laughs> oh bonobo! Oh bonobo! <laughs> doing little flips and jumps oh, through the holes. Keep, you can't keep tapping my booty while I'm doing spooky things. Okay? Takes a little bit of spookiness out and replaces it with even more spooky things. That's just a pile of bodies. That's probably not. Safety regulation. Uh oh. <clears throat> oh, nice. This is bad for gamer. Give him the double swing, the triple swing, the quadruple swing, the quintuple swing. Wow. Uh, it got me like a face hugger. Yeah. <laughs> what are you doing? Do you want to come up? <laughs> she tried so hard to sneak in right there, and she 
hung on with two front paws and did like the scope. It was very good. May okay, maybe I'll aim better this time and like not miss so many times. But the again, depth, weird. If you were playing this in VR, you could perceive the depth of the space. You would never play this in VR. I live, I live. Come here, asshole. I'm waiting for you. Sir. That's the cat. That's the cat. Yes. 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 Whenever I see Olive and she comes up in my lap, I go, yes. Yes, that's the cat. This is what it felt like when I broke my finger playing soccer. Yes. Oh, the purrs. Oh, the purrs. You're doing great, Julia. Oh, the purrs. I hit him. You're doing great, Julia. I hit the hand. Will you hit? I'm going to say that was the effectively hand bullshit. The feeds you. Will you stay down on your Thank knees? Thank you, chat, for agreeing with me. Will you hit? The hand that feeds you. Like, there was the sound and everything. Bonk. Get him. Get him. I almost bopped our friend. Your friend is unboppable. Nice bonk. Nice bonk. Okay, that's exactly what I did to the last hand. Good sure. bonk. Yes. Nice. Nice job, gamer. Good work, speedrunner. They gotta do something about the hands being alive in here. Oh! Um, oh, this might not be the chapter for Jacob. I'm not freaked out by digital. Okay. I mean, I watch horror movies. That's true. I don't care about any sort of fake uh, nastiness. It's only when you're watching like real surgery documentaries and I'm like, that's a real person. That's what gets me. I don't like this. Does anyone like this, really? What the heck is that? What? Whoa! Wow. Yeah! Yay! Yay! I love this guy. I love the walrus man. He's here. He's here. He's great. Yeah. All right. Yeah. This is good. Aw, oh, he rules. He's doing slug stuff. He's just doing slug stuff. It's totally fine. It's From totally the ceiling. Fine. I love him. I'm like waiting for him to restart his like animation cycle. Take it, take it, take it, take it, take it. Oh my god. Oh no, see? He has legs. He's just like a dude on the ceiling. <laughs> I don't know why he's on the ceiling. I love he's this like, man! I love how he like crawls! A, he's like a big ceiling baby. It's not so bad. It's not so bad. He's just a big ceiling baby. I don't know why he's like putting together like horrible little mannequins, but you know. To each their own. I'm sure we do a lot of things a lot of people don't understand. See, hey, I this... had assumed that he didn't have like a real body, but he's got or like legs. He's got a freaking superior body. It allows him to crawl on the ceiling. Yeah. I can't do that with my normal body. I say this man has a better body than this I do. This is peak physical condition. That is core strength. That do you know how much core strength. strength you need to be doing those moves? Are you kidding me? Uh no. He can't see me from up there. He's just rumbling around. I love this guy. <laughs> Don't look at me.
I will take this man any day over. Over neck teacher? Over neck teacher. He's definitely better than neck teacher. <laughs> so I really just love the way he moves around. It's so good. It's so like bumbly, go, go, like go, go, it's go, 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 go. smacking into other things. I, okay, so I'm assuming I can't go over there. This feels like a vulnerable position. I mean, I agree with you, but there's nowhere I can really go. Keep going underneath the, the tools. Materials. Looks like I need something. I need to throw something. Oh, okay. There's some little blocky dudes over there. He just keeps running into the lights, too. I really like that. Like, he just doesn't care. Did I just screw myself? No, I'm fine. I love it. I really thought he would just have like one long like leg with like the two little feeties picking at you know poking out like a little like a little walrus tail. But no, he's just a dude on the ceiling. He's just a dude on the ceiling. I see nothing wrong with this. I see this. nothing wrong with this. Sometimes this is how I feel during quarantine. Hooked on the ceiling. That's good. I do like that. I'm gonna sneeze, you ready? <coughs> you didn't say bless you. Bless you. I'm sorry. I was focused on getting the monkey head. Thank you. I was just worried I might not be blessed. He's like a train. He is. I'm not so scared of this guy. Why would we be scared of our best friend? Who just rumbles around on the ceiling. Do you think I should go for it now? I think you should make the decision as to what you do so that I have no responsibility for what happens. That's what I would like. Oh, I should have hid. Hide now. Easy mode. No problem. I ain't scared of no ceiling man. He's just a ceiling man. What's he gonna do? What's he gonna do? He can't do nothing. Damn, bold move from your little friend. What are you gonna do? Go in your filing cabinets, look at your files? Oh. You had a cool track right there. You gonna go consult your papers? Oh, this is dangerous. Mm -hmm. I think it's friend cool is like stuck in us. that he's a ceiling man, but he's learned to adapt to using all of this floor-based furniture. You know? He's a smart dude. I feel like good, he good has on him. All. He's got core strength. He's got the ability to adapt. Uh, uh. He's got the brains. Got the brains. Got the brawn. This man is a catch. He can make... You, a child, in a really odd way, but he can you make can you make, a child. He can make a child for you. For you. I don't trust these drop ceiling tiles. Yeah, he about to rumble volcano his way across the ceiling and. Oh no! I got I got crawl down. You gotta this. go down. I'm going down, down. Well. All right, that's one way to do it. I'm just waiting for him to go rumble ass and in here. All right, nothing you can do about that. 
Nothing I can do about that. Can I do something about this? It is also time to end the stream. Just so you know. Well, okay. For whenever you're ready to do that. Yeah, send me back in, kid. I'm going back to my friend. The Rumble Man. Do we see where a key would be? Do we think it's one of these? Oh, oh. found it. People are saying hat in chat. Where? It's, it's a hat chat. Where? I don't know where. They're just saying it. Hat and locker with a mismatched hinge. That's good coordination, Jacob. Thank you. I've never practiced that. <laughs> I think no one would suspect that we had never practiced that. I don't know what you're talking about. Hat. Hello. Uh, Next to the, the sink. Is it in the previous room? In the Next back. Next to the sink. In the, the back. back. Okay, all of those look pretty. Just opening the doors is enough to find it. It's heavy. There it is. There it is. All right. Okay. Okay. Oh, that's a good. That's a good head. Oh, I'm always I, a fan of I the wraps. I like that one. You look like a Bloodborne character. I do. I'm always a fan of the wraps. You look like actually this one guy from Bloodborne, literally. Who had his head wrapped up like that and ends up turning into a, a werewolf and then murdering you. You know how it is. Well, that's a real shame. We all know how it is. Nice pull-ups. <laughs> oh, I gotta go from the sink. Got it. Is this Blood Priest Yankee? Look at those little toesies. I'm trying to remember what the, the Bloodborne NPC's name is. Maybe someone in chat will tell me. Of the man. What? What? I just bounced off an invisible wall. Let's hear about the man. Not Father Gascoin. That's a different man. You know that's a different man, he doesn't, chat. He doesn't have a name. Just the beggar, I think. Suspicious beggar, yeah. The boys, the boys, the boys, the boys, the boys. Stop. Maybe he doesn't have a name. Maybe it is just suspicious beggar. Sus beggar. Slam me back in, boss. No, I'm not thinking of the thief merchant from Dark Souls 3. I'm looking it up. I think it's Suspicious Beggar. Hey, I have the key. I have... Game? Game? Game. Yeah, it is the Suspicious Beggar. Because he turns into a horrible wolf man. See, he looks like this. Ah, okay. You missed uh, me attempting to put the key in the hole. And then he turns into that. Get you a man who can do both. And he gets you. Um, You missed me trying to put the key in the hole like 12 times in the game. Just being like, you can pick one up. Oh, was it the game? Or was it the game player? Like the classic Bible verse goes. 
don't hate the game, hate the player. You're really playing yourself right now. Comma, Pharaoh, because Moses said it to the Pharaoh. <laughs> In Old Testament Bible, Book I'm of leaving. Moses. I'm leaving. Verse 2, line 2. Look it up. Are we done streaming? <laughs> what? Apparently, we're almost done with this chapter. Like, how almost? If it's like two minutes, we'll just finish out the chapter now. If it's like another ten, we'll leave it to next time. Very close. Less than 20 minutes. Probably like 20 minutes. No, we're going to wait then. Okay, yeah. We got to go to bed. We got to go to bed. We got to work. We have work to do tomorrow. You did that. And then you ran away from it. You ran away from your own mistake. We will play it again. Coward. Next Sunday. Yes. And uh, Droppy stream tomorrow night. Droppy stream tomorrow night. So tune in for that. Unless you're afraid of good drawings. It's going to be a lot less spooky than this. We don't know that for sure. That's true. But probably. Uh, but yeah, and then on My Wednesday, so I'll be playing more There Is No Game. So if you tune into the There Is No Game stream, expect more of that on Wednesday. That's it. That's it. Olive's trying to get over here again. She's probably going to knock down your water bottle again. Uh, that's it for us. We're leaving. We will see y'all next time. Goodbye. Bye.